Ten twenty six here with special guest. Hi, I'm my sister Frances. <laughs> and how old are you again? I'm fourteen. Oh you know yeah, that? because the audience wants to know what. How old are you now? Because oh yeah, you mean the track one. So today we're going to review the new Steve Carell magical comedy film, The Incredible Burt Wonderstone. Of course, The Incredible Burt Wonderstone stars a bunch of cast. Steve Carell, of course. I was really excited for this movie because I haven't seen Steve Carell in his movies for a long time. I haven't seen Seeking a Friend to the End of the World, and I thought that critics really liked it. I, since I um, see this movie, and I saw the reviews for this movie saying that critics really hated this movie. They crushed my beloved Steve Carell. Anyways, let's go get on to the cast. And all the stars, Alan Arkin. Steve Buscemi, Olivia Wilde, I can't pronounce her name that time, but um, it's all about this um, Bert, this um, this magician named Bert Wonderstone played by Steve Carell. He receives a magic kid, f uh, um, I'm having a difficult time explaining the plot. Um, anyways, he gets a magic kid f for his birthday when he was a kid and he starts um, watching these tapes like VHS. We haven't have VHS. Do we have VHS that time? VHS, like these tapes, like you can put into the. Well, today, no. Yeah. Until now, they're still used today. Until props. now. Props. Yeah, yeah. Props. Uh, I must say that the plot in this movie, instead of um, not explaining to you all, this was. The movie itself was pretty decent. It should have been better because some of the jokes here kind of fall flatter. And sometimes there's this one scene that I really laughed out, laughed out a lot. There's this one scene where they open this um, what do you call that thing? Like a thing like you can put soup in. Something, something that you can put soup in, and it has smokes them, and they get like you know. What's that that line did he say it again in the movie? You think this works? I guess so. Open it. Oh yeah, now I remember when they were testing out that knockout formula. Yeah. Was and they were and they repeated their lines. It was so hilarious. That's one of the most funny scenes in the movie ever. But the movie itself was like the whole movie. It's just completely dismembered. I mean they were I haven't seen Don Scardino's movies because this is my first time watching them. And um, Steve Buscemi, you are a curse in my butt for watching comedy movies. You are not so good at this film. But you tried your best, you're still awful. But Steve Carell, of course, acts like this magician, plays Burt Wonderstone, the main character of the film. Her, his character feels like a douchebag. Seriously. He... Like, example, when um, Burt Wonderstone finally meets his partner once again after his um, bro they broke up, right? Yeah. And they, and they met in this like bar thing, when where they met, they sat at each other. I thought one of the funniest scenes ever when they they um Steve Carell was crying like a crying baby, and that was really funny. Mm -hmm. So Francis, what do you think of the Incredible Burt Wonderstone? It was funny. Some of the scenes they were a bit. Corny. How do I say this? Yeah, there's also corny, also at the same time disturbing. Yeah, I think in my opinion, one of the best. Excuse me. 
the best characters in this movie is ser seriously Jim Carrey. I know that Francis is really terrified of this character using his stunts. He's not really a magician, he's a street magician. As said in Wikipedia, he was one of the best characters in this movie. I love Jim Carrey's and seriously, Mr. Popper's Penguins was fantastic as heck. I like that movie, but this movie, his acting, and the stunts that you say they're like, how do I say this? Goose. Yeah, so this movie, it should have been better. It's running out of time, so my, um, so hope you enjoyed this review. So, Cradle Burt Wonderstone, 7 out of 10 stars. What's your rating for this movie? I'd say about 6. Okay, 6, 7, that's following. So, please subscribe or I'll shoot you with my shotgun!